Hello everybody. Today we will demonstrate how to use a marketing cloud journey builder. For the case you would like to create a promo campaign and as the most marketers you uh, don't have the full information about your clients. In some cases let's say you have only email address, in other cases you have only phone number that your clients provided you with. But you would like to maximize the coverage of the, your campaign and you would like to use to the full all information you have. Okay, we will create a multi-step journey, let's say, to some drama campaign journey. We will start with the data extension. Uh, it may be a master data extension where you keep all the information about your clients. Done. And to implement the, um, the feature of communicating with uh, your clients with different communication channels, we will use the flow control feature decision split. What does it mean? It means that depending on the fact uh, which uh, information your client pro provided you with, uh, your messaging to these clients will be different and we'll start with the email for the, uh, with the case when you have emails of your customers we have to to use filter criteria uh, it will be as you assume email address Did not know. Uh, we assume that you have uh, carefully prepared database where all email addresses that uh, are not equal to null are royal email addresses uh, to which you can use to send emails. Done. And now uh, you can send, let's say, uh, an email to these people. Let's say it will be email with a discount code you have prepared in advance. Okay, now we we'll work with the second group uh, with people that have provided you only with their uh, phone number, and you would like to send send them a kind of SMS or in-app message and uh, encourage them to visit your website. We'll name this decision split uh, mobile. And the filter criteria we will use this case will be mobile number and uh, this information should not be equal to null. First pass, yes, people that provided you with data, and the second pass is no for the case you do not have data at all. As you see, um, uh, in this case, uh, your uh, customers will uh, exit the uh, journey on the first day. Now we would, uh, will add in that message. Uh, well, Discount. Actually, your uh, journey may look uh, like this, but we assume you are a smart marketer that would like to uh, say thank you to those of customers that made a purchase on your website, and you would like to encourage those of them who does not react to your uh, previous messaging. And for this case, we will use another decision split. purchase and the filter criteria we'll use this time is the fact uh, of purchase purchase made uh, the value is true summary and 
will send, uh, let's say, thank you email. And uh, to will send a kindly reminder to those of your customer that uh, does not make a purchase. Okay, and for the case, I'd like to communicate uh, with my customers to say them thank you, not in one day, but say in two days, three days after the purchase. I have only to change the duration here, and it is uh, wise to send a reminder, let's say, after after three or four days after the first email was sent. I will change the duration here as well. Okay, uh, the same we can repeat with the uh, customers that have provided you with a mobile number, but uh, the idea is the same. Uh, on, the uh, on the third or on the uh, fifth day accordingly, uh, your customers should uh, exit the journey and you will see the result of your campaign to analyze it and um, decide if it was successful or it was a failure. I would uh, like to notice that during uh, the campaign's execute, uh, the, uh, during the execution of the campaign, you can create some uh, several versions of your journey to adjust your messaging or adjust the steps your uh, customers will follow during this journey. And this feature allows you to be as flexible as possible when working with your uh, customers and uh, when executing your campaigns. I hope that this um, video was really helpful to you. Uh, in case you have any questions, please uh, comment right under the video or uh, visit our web website and uh, follow in the contact form. Okay, see you and wish you a nice day.